I'm Kat and and welcome back to Hollow Hollow. It's Wednesday, which means it's time for our weekly ATK segment with Cindy J. Lee. Welcome, Cindy. Hi, Kat. <laughs> so we've got a lot of K-pop news to cover, but first some drama, right? Yes. E-Tame and Yewon, you know, that thing has been going on the feud. So apparently uh, the show they were on, the reality show, is getting mm -hmm. cancelled because the uh, ratings uh. dropped so much after that fight. What I find interesting about this is usually when there's like a feud going on in America, the ratings kind of go oh, up. Uh, because they're like, I've never heard about this show, and then they want to watch it, they want to see who these characters are, but in Korea, you just, you know, you just have to protect your reputation. Yeah. <laughs> if anything goes bad, wrong, then it doesn't help you in any way. Like, bad publicity is bad publicity. It's not, nothing good about it. So the ratings weren't good to begin with, but after that, it just went, it just went down. But um, on the plus side, uh -huh. um, Yewon's other show, she has another show called We Got Married. It's okay. when they put like two celebrities together and they pretend like they're a married couple. Uh -huh. It's a reality show as well. Um, that one, they thought, oh, it's going to get canceled as well. And she's married, married um, with <laughs> Henry from Super Junior okay. in that show, but um, that's not getting canceled, so that's good, good to news. know. Yeah. So she has one bad, one good. Yeah, <laughs> I just feel sorry for the other girl, E-Tame. Now moving right along, we have some romance news, right? Lee Min Ho and Susie. Yeah, well, yeah. Um, they, yeah last week it was uh -huh. announced that they're dating. Right. They've been dating for like a month or two. Now details are coming out, like how they met. Apparently, Imi No is the one that um, uh, expressed interest in Susie, uh -huh. and uh, Susie is the nation's first love. Okay. So Susie's like the most popular idol in Korea, right. and a lot of uh, male celebrities mm -hmm. are kind of sad that Susie's taken, and they're like, oh my gosh, I heard the news and it just ruined my day. <laughs> and they're all saying this, but then Emin was the first guy mm -hmm. who actually asked her out. Oh. So he made the move and he got her. Yeah. Uh, so everyone else is like, oh, I should have asked her out first. And um, they're digging out like old interviews of, mm -hmm. in Korea, they have this thing called like, oh, ideal type. What's your ideal type? Right. And it's a really commonly asked question. And um, her ideal type actually didn't match Emin uh -huh. They're like, huh? Well, what's up with that? Because um, she likes guys who have like, um, who only have like one eyelid, oh that double gosh, eyelid, or so something like that. And they're like, but he has two double eyelids. I'm the like, horror. okay, whatever. And then for him though, it matches because uh -huh. he likes girls who are like shorter and um, who uh, have really white faces. I know in Korea they love white skin, and <laughs> so then you know they're like, oh, Susie is the right match for him. But I don't know about Susie's choice for him. I don't know. There's whole things going on, but um, that's that. <laughs> okay, they're, they're... that's quite interesting. Yeah, it is quite interesting, isn't it? <laughs> what about Boa? Boa! Oh my gosh, Boa. I love Boa. Um, she is also coming back with um, new music either end of this month uh -huh. or beginning of May. So um, sometime around that period. Um, she hasn't come out with new music in three years. Oh, this wow. is like, yeah, she, she came out with only one um, three years ago. That's her seventh album. And now she's come out with new music. So fans are going crazy right now. <laughs> it's about time. Yeah, and Boa um, is t like around 28, 29 years old. But she debuted when she was like 13. So she's celebrating like 15 years in music. So yeah, it's, it's pretty amazing. Uh -huh. Yeah, so uh, she has some diehard fans out there, old and young. Yes. So <laughs> old and young. <laughs> now uh, BTS, they also have a comeback. Yes, uh, BTS right? is coming out with a new mini album, and, and now uh, they have a set date, April 29th. That's a lot of comebacks. Thank you so much, yes. Cindy, for giving us an update. Yeah, always a pleasure. <laughs> Time for a quick break, but don't go anywhere because singer-songwriter Chenza joins us all when we return.